So welcome to a very special video about Forza Horizon 2. This, this game's got 200 cars, an amazing amount of detail, and it's just a vast open world set in Southern Europe. So, so on the 10th of October, I'm going up north to Manchester to challenge you guys, you guys watching, or the general public to face me on Forza Horizon 2. So I need to hone my skills, I need to improve. So Xbox invited me down to Playground Games to check out the game and also get some helpful tips from the developers. So I went all the way to play around games and it was a pretty cool experience. I love games as you guys know and to literally talk to developers and see where this game is made is just, it's just mind blowing for me. So I loved it to bits. But also, instead of just like playing the game by myself, they had developers actually sit next to me and give me constant tips and sort of improvements I can make to my driving. So I'm ready for the Manchester trip on the 10th of October. So normally when I play racing games, I do stick with a controller. I have no wheel in my room and this time they sort of chucked me in the deep end Yo Scott, try this wheel out, it's absolutely awesome. So I was in this massive rig, McLaren, it's like P1 style rig, it looks absolutely insane. I had this massive speaker ne next to my ears, really false feedback, crazy wheel, and I was like trying to learn all the, all the techniques, and the guy next to me was helping me out so much, the developer was awesome, giving me loads of little tips, when to lift, when to coast, when to brake, when to just accelerate like a crazy man, and it was awesome. Um, I had a lot of time, I was pretty bad at it to be honest, but I was learning, as I went, as they gave me more and more tips, I was slowly improving from an absolute noob with a wheel to someone that can actually drive a car around a track. The Forza Horizon 2 has massive amounts of open world game, but you've got to try and decide what vehicles you use. So some events may suit like a Land Rover Brawler, some may suit a Mini, who knows? I don't know, probably not, but it's highly unlikely. But there's a lot of difference between being on a road and being on like dirt, being on grass and crazy stuff like that, being, being off road is so fun but you lose the grip so picking like a Land Rover Brawler just gives you that grip four wheel drive lots of traction that's definitely one of the comments uh, one of the developers gave me which is essential to me going into the full game and being ready this game is crazy and so much fun I love the fact you can actually pick a Land Rover and run over some crops I mean the, 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 my, my mind boggles it's so cool but yeah picking like a, a P1 for example the P1 is just so it just plants the floor, so much grip, so much power. You see the wing move as you break, it's so awesome. And then you pick these really rare Quattro Audi rally cars, which are just insane. So I used to watch this program called um, Ashes to Ashes, and I was like, I love that car. And you can actually drive in the game, which is so incredible. These cars are so rare. And then you've got these really crazy old cars, which look absolutely amazing. They look so pretty, but they handle like so different. So the back wheels would just constantly lose grip. And you're always like feathering the throttle like oh do i accelerate do i not accelerate and it's just so challenging and fun to sort of face against perhaps some modern cars or race against other retro cars as well so what i'm gonna do now is leave with my favorite race of my training day so this is me mike you may know him as fear Crads, facing a developer who is super quick the fastest developer in the building which is absolutely crazy so if you haven't checked out the demo already on xbox live make sure you do forza horizon 2 type it in definitely check it out also, check out my Twitter, at GameLightArmy, and check out Xbox UK's Twitter. We'll be tweeting on the day, on the 10th of October. Make sure you come by it if you live nearby, around the station. But yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Hit it with a like, make sure you share it and stuff with your friends, and have an awesome day. Bye-bye.